want me to give you a red carpet? Oh man, now we've fucking done it. We? No, you've done it. You brought the freaking cattle to my place. <laughs> this, this is exactly why they came. Because of your racist statements. It was an accident. Oh man, we're fucked. I'll tell yeah, you that. It's just, I, I mean, it's you accidental saw that horse this morning. Saying, you know, he, he was big, fast, and athletic, and he still died. I'm gonna miss the watching the park run throughs. Fuck, what is he said? I, uh, a park run through. Now we're in a park run through, you idiot! No, we're in a van. Ugh, we're oh, so right. dead. Look! A fucking rat zombie! Two of them! Don't make eye contact. Oh man, this is seriously freaking me out. Chill, we're in a van, we're fine. Yeah. Well, speaking of fine places, dark. look at this. Uh. Hey, don't read and drive. Relax, Larry. There's no traffic anymore. Of course there is. We're the traffic. Whatever. You just keep an eye on the road then. But listen to this. Oh, it's yeah. It's an ad for a sure. scavenging guild on the back of the bull's map. It says they have rooms, electricity, and running water. Wow. Well, wait. But the bulls live there. So what? It has a very inviting message. Uh... Maybe they'll let us join. I doubt the bulls are the ones running the place. Well, it beats living in a rat zombie infested town. Yeah, so. They um... have points next to each item. Looks like this is how you pay for your stay. Oh, with items you bring? Yeah. So that's what the bulls were doing. Huh. Does it say where the guild is? Hmm, no. Looks like that part's missing. Of course. It must be somewhere in this town. We'll find it, but we should scavenge a few items so they'll let us in. I'm done with that. But we need to bring at least something. Whatever. We don't even know where it is. Is that a guinea pig walking down the road? What? Mm hmm Well, it's good to know that some of us little guys can make it out here. That is reassuring. Although I'm sure this is one tough guinea pig surviving on his own. And look at us. What are we good for? That's not a bad question. What are we good for? Drugs. Larry, bad. I've got an idea. We may not be strong like those bulls, or motivated by addiction like or that fixing good, I guess. Do have all these walkie-talkies in the back. We can exchange them. For food? No. I have an even better idea. What if we get that guinea pig to do the scavenging for us? Well, why in Spot's name would he want to do that? Because I'll convince oh. him. That's what I'm good for. Ah, uh, jeez. Why are you pulling over? You're actually gonna ask this random animal to scavenge for us? Fuck yes. Sir, hello. You're not serious. Hello. Greetings, travelers. I'm Hank, and this is Larry. I'm Elliot. You look like the apocalypse has been treating you well. Really? That's the kindest thing anyone has ever said to me. Absolutely. Anyhow, we have a proposition for you. We know about... About an easy place for scavenging. An easy place for scavenging. Easy. And we can show it to you. Deceived. Oh. Thanks? Well, here is the proposition. You go in and scavenge the place while we are your safety lookouts. You will take this walkie-talkie, and we'll watch you with binoculars and guide you to safety. So you want to show me this place and help me scavenge it? This is really kind, but why would you do that? Because we'll both benefit. After you come back, we would keep... We would keep... It will keep. Uh, I 
want 50 but he would Fifty percent of the loot. You want me to give you half of the loot? Yeah. I I don't know. Let me take the weekend to think it over. Okay, listen. How about if we keep forty uh, percent of the loot? No, I'm sorry. Oh, for fuck's sake. Well, it was nice meeting you, but I, I really think I should be going now. Okay, okay. This is our final offer. We keep only. Fucking dirty! Seriously! I think I have to go, guys. For okay, fuck's sake! How much do you want us to keep? Not to be rude or anything, but since I'm going to be the one doing the dangerous job, I think I should keep 90% of the loot. What? Are you crazy? What? Oh, never mind then, guys. Okay, okay, we'll do it your way. You keep 90%, but only because we like you. Alright, why not? Making new friendships is very important these Huh. Oops. Fuck off. Fuck! Okay. Totally. And this should be fun. We should beat him I up. Never thought of scavenging on a team this way. This is the only safe way to scavenge nowadays. Oh, but wait. Why? Have you ever done this kind of thing before? Uh, yeah. Well, We've yeah. Been doing this. For almost Holy. a whole week. At least I'm not your first experiment. <laughs> nah, we wouldn't use you to get big. <laughs> oh, man, did it again. Oh, for fuck's sake, Hank. Th that's such a terrible stereotype. Those were extremely hard times for guinea pigs. Oh, fuck off, it's Spider. okay, really. I'm sure you didn't mean anything by it. Yeah, of course I did. Sure. So, where is this great scavenging place? Dude, I can't believe this actually worked. So where are we taking him? Let's choose one of the places on the map. The bulls have them marked as potentially good places for scavenging. Okay, dude, climb aboard. Oh dear, what happened to your eye? Just ran into some door. Oh, okay. Alright, time to go. Then ball fight. Drugstore, bus station, camp. Sexual supplies. I mean, we kind of need. Here we are. Good idea. Toilet ah, supply store? I guess I was expecting something a bit. uh. different. Fucking bulls marked it as essential supplies. Who? Never mind. I'm sure we'll find oh, some shit. useful things here. At least for trading. Yeah, I think you're right. Okay. I'm going in. Hmm. I'm in front of the store. The door's locked. You have the lock picking set I gave you? Well, I'm not really sure how to use it. Don't worry, I'll guide you. Yeah. Shit. 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 Fuck. Fuck. And fuck. Motherfucker. Ah. Wow, fucking bulls. Ah. Done. That was one peculiar lock picking technique. Let's not overanalyze it. It works. Let's see. Uh, wait, what is it? Oh. oh it. Good value. At least some of this stuff has a solid value, value in the Scavengers yes. Guild. Do you mean the Scavengers yeah, Guild west of here? I uh, yes, I think so. I hear that place is the best. They've got security, running water, sometimes even electricity. Sometimes. You know where it is? No, I don't. Fuck. I live with my family and a few friends. Not like the Gilders would let us join. Why not? They are very selective. Oh, oh. cabbage. How selective? Tremendously. I've heard from a few members. They only accept the best of the best. And there goes that plan. 
Hold your horses, Larry. Who says we're not the best of the best? Yeah. Horses. <laughs> Some more. More. Oh. Diaper packs? And more. Cool, cool. Back of the tent. Back of laps. Sure. And more. This is bandage. Oh, that was a paper. Oh, come on. Who made this? This is too easy. I know. I mean, do you right. really think he'll give us our percentage of the loot? Why wouldn't he? We're not doing anything for him. What would keep him from dodging us on the way out? Uh, drove him here. Yeah, but I mean, we'll deal. drive him over. Showed him a toilet goods store. So what are you suggesting? Let's say he avoids a zombie because of our help. Then he would feel like we were valuable and wouldn't just walk away with all the loot. Where do we get a zombie? From our wild imagination. We fake a zombie? Yeah, something like that. Not bad, Larry. I can see you finally learned something from me. <laughs> hey, don't take away my credit like that. Jeez, chill. Uh, Elliot, we've got a bit of a situation. Yeah, what, what is it? Uh... Have you killed zombies before? Yeah, but I don't want to go through that again. Well, then you oh, better hide and get real quiet. Y you see a zombie? Get away from the window! Alright, so what is it? A zombie? Uh. <sighs> yes, one headed your way. I closed the door. Trust me, closed doors are not much of an obstacle once they see you. Oh. You gotta hide. Okay. Good, just stay What's there. Alright. Uh, Is it gone? Nope, still wandering around. <laughs> oh my gosh. It's alright, it's alright. Okay, I think it's gone now. Are you sure? Yep. Good. Yep, I really I, want I can to see avoid one. facing them. You're safe with us. Yeah, thanks. Anything else for looting? Yeah, one more shell. That's yeah, taken. And. <sighs> okay. Yeah, I mean, I don't know if it's the bandages could be essential, and the wipes as well. But that one sounds. Wait, what the fuck is that? That one back. Well, I, we could take one for Grandpa. Oh wait, <laughs> there's another aisle around the corner that I missed. Uh. There's toilet paper. Head over there. Kind of seems out of your line of sight, though. After that last zombie scare, I don't really want to be where you can't see me. We'll listen for zombie-like sounds. What? These are high-tech army walkie-talkies. If we <coughs> increase the volume, we can detect anything. What if it's not making any sounds right now? Um... <sighs> Positive, it would have made some sounds by now. Yeah. You've been in the store long enough. I guess. Yeah, besides your main All right. noise, noise, so... So here are a few one-ply toilet papers. Just a few one-ply? Is that really as good as you can do? What's the difference? Well, um. one-ply, come on. Um, okay. Oh, Let me go further <coughs> down the aisle. Um, how fine so nice. It? There's a lot of two-ply here. Yeah! Zombie! Fuck. Zombie! Run, damn it! It's, it's half of a zombie. A zebra with no legs. And it's still moving! Elliot, are you making this up? Why would I do that? Who would make up Let's a zombie? Let's take and run, damn it. Well, maybe some animals in a very specific situation. But <laughs> listen, there can't be a zombie without legs. It would die. Unless it, like, uh, just lost its legs a moment ago, 
and didn't have time to bleed out yet. I'm telling you, it's a zebra with no legs. So what? Aren't we supposed to abandon all known science, logic, and reason? The freaking I know. Apocalypse? Okay, okay. Let me check it out real quick. No. I think... I yeah. think it's just a handicapped zombie. You mean it was handicapped oh. before it became a zombie? <laughs> yeah, I think. Well, that I can buy. Okay, Ellie. If it doesn't have any legs, then you're safe. Well, it's um. near the two-ply toilet paper. So what? You can't handle it? Well, I probably can, but still. Come on, two plies worth so much more. We really need those I mean, skill points to get in. So well, I good guess I do owe you guys one by. for saving me earlier. Well, you know what? If you're Can't afraid, let's skip this. I'm not afraid. Are you not? Whatever, just come back. Okay, I'm looting the one ply. Yeah. No need to risk. I mean, if. if the shit, the shooter kind of don't have a legs. Doesn't mean it doesn't have arms. Wait, is that, is that, is that a zebra? It would count as hooves. Yeah. It'll have to do. I'm coming back. Yeah, come on. You did great. So here's your part of the loot. Right, fucking hell. Oh, oh for fuck's sake, who made this system? Manage could be useful, yes. Oh, fuck. Do we need protection? No. Ruby, Shit. see you around. Bye. Fuck. Where next? Mm, let's see. This is probably this drugstore. What? Oh. <coughs> you think we'll find some animals in that camp? That's what the map says. Uh, some sort of gathering place. I'll we'll see if we can find our next scavenger there. Where do we even get in the fuel? Huh. We're really doing this. Fuck yeah. We're scavenger guides now. Before we arrive, let's review a lesson from my notebook. Alright, let's see what you got in there. This is what's going to truly make us successful. Wait, I could have been doing it beforehand. I actually read a few books on influence. I'm curious if you know what you're talking about. So what? You're gonna judge my real life experience with your book knowledge? How do you think these books were written? From fictional experiences? I don't know. Anyhow, let's start with the one I like to call phrasing matters. That is? Oh yeah, I remember this. Back when I was a life insurance salesman, I used to tell people, when you pass away, your family will get the money. But then I changed my words to, when you walk out, money walks in. And I doubled the sales. It's extremely important how you phrase things to animals. Yeah, that makes, makes sense. sense. Okay, so how do we use this phrasing in our case? Uh, what words do we use a lot? Hmm. Killed. Uh, fuck shit. Act, scavenge? Yes, we use that one a lot. Oh, uh, yeah, scavenge. Instead, let's use, uh... Hmm. Gathering resources. Sounds good. Uh, of course, we only want to use this one if we want to soften the level of danger in a prospect's mind. If we want to mm -hmm. intimidate him, we'll use the scariest version available. I agree. That so is... what else do we use a bunch? Yeah. Zombie. Yes. Zombie. Let's see. Hmm. Walkers? Nah, Walking Dead's worn out that one. <laughs> I mean, it's pretty good, but... Lurkers? Spiders? Lurkers? Walking Dead. Right. Fuck. That one sounds even scarier than Zombie. So it should be good for intimidating. Yes, but we need something that takes away that power. That yes. makes our prospect less scared. And easier to convince the scavenge for us. Like... Bastards? That's dumb. Bastards. 
Dead fur? I don't know. Still scary. Uh, How about weirdos? Hmm. Weirdos? That could work. I mean, they are weird. Making weird sounds and movements. Well, yeah. then let's think some more. Nah, there's the camp. I mean, those will do. Hmm. Wow, look. There are a few animals here after all. Good. Let's talk to our new prospects. Wunderbar. All right. Seems pretty cozy. Let's see if somebody's up for some scavenging. And if they know anything about the guild. Oh. Hello, ma'am. What do you want? Just the conversation. How's the zombie apocalypse treating you? Oh, just awesome. My husband was the first to go. And then my little Joey hopped away in the middle of the woods and I haven't seen him since. Oh. And then... That's terrible. You don't know the half of it. Well, if your kid's missing, then what's in your pouch? Hank, that's a little forward. It's fine. If I can survive my husband being devoured, I can survive a little rudeness. Anyhow. I'm sure your supplies won't last forever. How do you feel about some... resource collecting? What are you talking about? We can show you an awesome place and guide you while you pick up some items. Your black eye friend looks like he could use some guiding. Me? Nah. He already did. <laughs> This little thing is from a friendly bar fight. I'm sure. There are so many bars around. Anyhow, I need to stick around the camp in case my Joey shows up. All right. But let sure. me just tell you that... Stop trying to sell me your scam, rabbit. Okay, okay. And how Stupid about... Room. Some trading. Sure. Let me see what you got. Ah... <sighs> What is that? The life of Don Danny the bear. Wait, why the fuck do we? Fury trial red line. Go. Go. That's awesome. Hmm. That seems fair. Yep. See you around. I seriously need to start. Oh, come on. Don't tell me it's that slow. Lovely day, isn't it, sweetheart? Excuse me? It's a lovely day? Yeah, it's just great. I love the landscape sprinkled with corpses. As long as they're not walking. Right. Can I help you, Rabbit? We're looking for a strong, healthy individual to assist us with... ...scavenging. What kind of assistance are you talking about? We'll bring and guide you through... ...a resource collecting place. And we'll keep you safe from... ...weirdos. Who? 
You know, weirdos. What weirdos? The crazy biting animals. You mean zombies? Some might call them that, but nowadays, they're usually called weirdos. You two yeah. are weirdos. I told you we should keep thinking about the name. Nah, yeah, no. this is good. It'll stick oh, come eventually. On. And then when you come back, we'll split the loot. No, I don't think so. Why not? Look, I'm trying to join the Scavengers Guild. Maybe you've heard of them? I'm not wasting my time and risking my life with you two losers. That's awesome. We're also hoping that... Just a second, Larry. <laughs> uh, what he's saying is that... Shut up, Fido. We're from the Scavengers hmm. Guild, and we can totally help you out. Seriously? Why didn't yeah. you say so? Uh, we don't like to brag. Oh, okay. So you can help me join? Yeah, but yeah. I don't know if you heard, it's really hard to get in. Yeah, I did. But if you go scavenge with us, we'll put in a good word for you. Right. No, seriously. Word of mouth gets you in eventually. Hmm, I guess. Plus, you have nothing to lose. We'll keep you safe from weirdos. Hmm, okay. I am considering this little venture of yours. Then you should consider that... You'll just fly through that place. In and out in no time. Yeah? Hmm, that sounds good. I really like don't want to get stuck in some hellish building surrounded by zombies. Not a chance of that scenario happening. Yeah, okay, that's I'll impossible. do it. But I want to keep 70% of the loot. 70? Would 70 I mean, it's better than 90. Take it or leave it, Gramps. You know how dangerous it is out there? Don't you try scaring me. We'll do it my way, or we won't do it at all. Fine, fine. You can keep 70%. Okay, let's do this thing. By the way, I'm Hank, and this is Larry. Okay, I'm Krista. We'll be yeah, back in a minute. minute. We want to talk with a few more animals before we go. All right, but come back before side. I change my mind. We kind of need to stop at some point. God damn it, this course is so damn fucking slow. Hello there. Hi. Are you here to throw some dice? Maybe, but we have a few questions first. Have you heard about the Scavengers Guild? Yeah, I played a game of dice with a few guilders. Do you know where they're located? Nope. Any useful information you can give us? They are terrible at gambling. Oh, you're a big <laughs> help. Thanks. Well, how about taking a break and playing a game? Actually, we have a proposition for you. Uh, I'm listening. We're about to head out to, a uh, Scavenging site. Care to join us? No thanks, gentlemen. Are you sure? Could collect more items to gamble. I've got plenty. Really? All right then. So, do you want to try your luck in a simple dice game? Yeah. Sure, but tell me the rules first. Okay, you have three dice, and I have three dice. We All each right. take turns throwing a dice. Whoever gets a higher total number wins. But if someone gets a total that is higher than ten, he loses. You can choose to throw or hold each dice. You got it? Yeah. Let's do. start then. Show me the items you want to wager. Throw. 
nine. I'll hold the dice. Fuck! What the fuck? Tough luck. Want to try again? Yes. Sure. Show me the items you want to wager. Fuck. 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 Fuck! Tough luck. Wanna try again? Fuck off. Ah, okay. Come back later. Fuck! I lost the most valuable shit. Alright, go lady. C Catherine, what was it? Hey. You losers ready? Yes, let's go. Let's go. So where are we going? Drugstore. Here we are. Pharmacy, <sighs> huh? Yup. Let's get started. All right. Here I am. We see you. Mm -hmm. Door's locked. Okay. You remember how to use the lock picking tools? Vaguely. Don't worry, I'll help you. Oh, good. How that? Damn it. And Houdini. Done. I did it. Here's some cough syrup. Good. Yep. Take it out. And a few first aid kits. Oh, that should be viable. Roll of gauze. Gone. Well, right, that's and. it. Really? Seriously? Actually, there's a basement door. Good. Go down there. Most of the items are probably stored there. I don't think so, Gramps. I can't see a thing from up here. On uh, second thought, we'll skip that part. Come back to us. All right, coming back. Yeah, I don't think that's a good idea to go somewhere. That I'm was getting a real trapped time there. waster. It's not our fault you were afraid of the basement. Fuck off, Gramps. Here's your part of the loot. Wow, so generous. Seventy percent being yours. Fucking bitch. And oh come on. Wow, so generous of you. All right, I guess this will have to do. You Fuck guess. Now. Wait, so where is the Scavengers Guild? Oh, that thing. Uh, <laughs> I'll try Trevor. joining after you guys tell them about me. The location? Yes. It's, uh, it said. Uh, hostile. Isn't that the place with prostitutes? <laughs> yeah. Uh, it used to be. Hmm. Used are you guys be. really from the guild? Of course we are. Of course. I just have a hard time believing that's the location. Well, I didn't choose it. Yeah. I'll be seeing you around. See you at the guild. Where next? Fuck. Hmm, let's see. Well, I think we should... And somewhere here because it's, there's not enough storage now. Yeah, that that stuff here already <coughs> exceeding my limit. So I don't know. I had a lot of excitement for this game, but I guess they live to my standards. But I guess we'll at least finish this game at other time. No, at least it was cheap, even with discounts. A couple 30 cents. No. Anyway, this was the normal session, man. <laughs> and drink some water, lads. I'll be seeing you. Goodbye.